So we could have most likely the world's biggest database on actual given MBB case prompts. Here is why we do not. So we are finding us in a situation where we often need to justify why we don't have a case library with 100, 200, 300, 400, 500 cases to go through and practice. And if we would be so successful as we are always telling, why we wouldn't have the world's biggest database on actual MBB case prompts. That's a clear reason, right? Because it wouldn't help. It wouldn't help us, it wouldn't help you, and the MBBs wouldn't like it. And let me go through this one by one and also explain the rationale behind this. Now, why it wouldn't help us. So what we have seen in the past over and over and over again, if you have a large repository of things, what people and especially individuals that have been graduated um, recently or only a couple of years back are doing is they're treating it like old exams for university, right? So they are going through this, they are learning everything there, and then they are sitting there and knowing a lot, but are not really capable of a lot. And, and the problem is that Many individuals have so institutionalized to learn things by heart, right? To essentially, uh, yeah, trying to go through as many repetitions as anyhow possible without even understanding the mechanism that is relevant and that will be evaluated in the actual interviews. So it's a wrong path to prepare for MBB interviews because what this will give you is that you will be the king in terms of learning for a vocabulary test, when actually what is tested here is the mechanism that you go from question to answer, right? That you use in order to go from question to answer. And, and this is exactly not what a case library is giving you. And why this is a disadvantage for us is because the results will be significantly lower compared to a case library with 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, whatsoever, 100 cases, right? This is comparing input. We don't care about input, we care about output and having a huge case library that people are going through um, treating it like university exams in their preparation is a disadvantage and will not lead to the same results that we are used to. So clear no from our end. And the same is also true why it's not an advantage of our mentees, because it's tempting to do exactly this whilst we are pushing them through a set of fundamentals first before they even are able to go through actual case prompts in an end-to-end -end way. And why this is so important is because you will need to have a theoretical understanding of what you are tested up on, what is evaluated in these interviews before you even start to show it, right? Because most people, what they are doing is, oh, let me just like try to get into casing. What you should get into at the beginning is analytical investigation, right, is the basics, the fundamentals of problem solving. And then it's fine to apply it, but don't apply it in a situation where you're just more or less learning old cases by heart, but instead make sure that you're applying it in a real life situation with people that either can calibrate your performance or at least are building on the same theoretical fundament here to make it a systematic journey. And why the MBBs don't like it, there are many reasons, but they don't like to find their actual case prompts online and we don't even need to go into whatsoever um, professional understanding here uh, and also um, business secrets and also yada, 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 because if it's not beneficial for us and if it's not beneficial for you and our clients, uh, it's, not, it's completely out of question, right? We would never share anything confidential. And it's also not necessary because in the end, what is tested is if you are great and outstanding and client ready problem solver. And there is certainly no confidential knowledge around this. So know how you're going to prepare, but please don't fall into the trap of expecting 300, 400, 500, whatsoever case libraries here in order to assess if this is a suitable preparation or not.
So long.